Paolo Duterte, who told a Senate hearing in September that he had not been involved in the smuggling of 6.4 billion pesos, dollars or 179 million, worth of methamphetamine hydrochloride, spoke with his father before announcing his immediate resignation on Monday. There are recent unfortunate events in my life that are closely tied to my failed first marriage, he said in a statement. He said they included reputational damage, when his name appeared in a Bureau of Customs smuggling case and a war of words with his daughter on Twitter. This is one of those instances in my life that I need to protect my honor and that of my children, he added. I hereby tender my resignation as Vice Mayor of Davo City effective December the 25th. On Tuesday, President Duterte told reporters that his son was fed up with the most unfair attacks against him, especially after he was called to the Senate to answer accusations. I told him you are in a position to do what is right, the President said, in reference to his son seeking counsel. Do what you think is right. Paolo Duterte denied the allegations during his appearance at the Senate hearing but refused a challenge by an opposition senator to show if he had a tattoo on his back which would allegedly indicate he was a member of the Chinese drug syndicate.